Robert, I really appreciate you inviting me up here to fish with you today. I know I've uh, read a little of your articles that you've done on this uh, piece of water here, which is uh, really a great experience for a lot of fishermen. And uh, th this has been open uh, actually under a year now. Right. And uh, anyway, tell me a little bit about what, what to expect today. Yeah, the, the, the tribe has already, uh, years have has had the uh, catch and keep. You know, you, you pay your, your permit and you get to catch the fish and keep them. Uh, now though, since uh, last, last uh, October, they came in with the idea of two and a half miles of catch and release only. And the thing about it is not only are small fish in here, there are large fish in here because when you put them back, they get a chance to grow. So it's been, it's been unique. Uh, I don't know where else in the country, I know in the south because people come from all over, where you can come and get a chance at a five and six pound trout on in a way, public water. You have to have a, go get your permit up here at uh, the reservation to fish, but anybody can do it at a very reasonable cost, too. You know, sounds reasonable to me. I tell you, uh, particularly what sounds good is the size of the fish. <laughs> I know. I am really anxious to catch some of these big guys. I, well, I'm ready. Let's go do it. After you. Tell you what, let's do. You um. Since you're the guest, we'll let you catch the fish. I'll, I'll do the net. Now, you can see the run right up here, the hole in here, shallows out here. And they should be, you know, like, see the white water right there? Uh -huh. It's a little bit, and comes up there, it's a little faster. Uh -huh. They should be holding right, right in through here. They ought to be. In fact, I'm so confident, buddy, I've got my net ready. Go get them, Steve. Well, I hope I don't disappoint you. <laughs> Go get them, buddy, you can do it. Right, I'm gonna catch hey. one fish and then you're gonna catch Sounds one. Sounds okay? good. To, I like the right. way you talk. I like the way you talk. Now, if I can get out of these bushes, I'll see if I can catch one. Boy, it is a beautiful time of year, isn't it? This is nice. This is nice. Wonderful. You couldn't ask for a better day. Okay. Right. The water's is. moving. The water is really going. I'm still not sure we'll get down there far I enough know. in this deep water. But we know the fish are there. See if we can just get one to take it. That's what we came for my, right my, there. My, my trout uh, recognizing skills <laughs> say that is a rainbow. What do you think? <laughs> I think that's a jumping rainbow is what that's I think. It's a jumping rainbow. Oh, he's beautiful. Good job. Good job. Okay. Good job. All right, buddy, I am ready with the net. Well, I'm going to give him a... The net he, fell. Yeah, yeah, I let that one fight a little bit. That would if we keep away from our legs. He's got some pretty good shoulders on him. Mm. I'm going to let him wire them shoulders nice down fish, for just nice a minute. Ooh. Oh, there you go. Don't you hate that sound? <laughs> oh, man, I tell you, that's a beautiful sound. What are you talking about? <laughs> what you live for? Yes, right, sir. Come on, buddy. Nice rainbow. Ooh, I tell you. Yeah, you don't want to use light. Amazing fight. This is not the place to use light tackle. It really isn't. I mean, you... Uh, I've always thought that in Carolina streams, a four, if you need one rod for a perfect rod, a four is fine. But here, here you can use a five. Most you, definitely. You can use a five. <laughs> or bigger. Yeah, or bigger, right, exactly. Yeah, I'll just get in the van, drive on down to Cherokee <laughs> and uh, stick the net out. And right before that fish hits the, uh, a kind of lefty, I'll, 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 I'll net it. How's that? You may have to. No, I think he's about ready to nice give up. Nice fish there, nice fish. Oh, yeah. Nice. Fish. That's what I came to do. Come on in here, buddy. Get everything nice and nice and damp here. Just, just scoot them on in. Come on in, buddy. Oh, All right, good doing? net. Pretty good fish. Net. Yes, pretty, sir. Fi pretty fish. Well, what a pretty very good job, Steve. Well, good job in that, there, Robert. Look at that rainbow. I appreciate it. What a pretty fish. Lovely, lovely. Oh, let him go. Oh yeah. Let's let him get back in there and grow about twice that size. I've seen some fish in here twice that size. <laughs> good job, fella. Oh, it was thank fun. you. It's fun. Way to, play good, Way to play him. That good net. All right, yeah, it's your to turn. Do it. Glad to do it. Well, I, you know. No, it's your we, turn uh, to catch one. I'll, I'll be the net man. Well, I had a, I had a good fight with that laurel I, I hooked a while ago. That, that, that was a pretty good fight. Well, hang in there. You're doing the right thing. You're. You're getting it right on the bottom, and that's where it needs to be. Come I on, I haven't got fish. a good look at him yet, but he sure is bending that rod. Ooh, man, good. Ooh, ooh, ooh. That's Hello, the fish, fish of the day. Hello, fish. <laughs> that is the fish of the day. 
Hello, fish. Man, what a fish. Golly. <laughs> Gee. Yeah, you better, you better get that fish does, on the rod and let this, him have a little drag. Does this fish know it's hooked yet? Oh, Whoa, man. how about a jump? <laughs> <laughs> I, may have, I don't know whether that fish will fit in this net or not, oh, Robert. Oh, man, oh, man, oh, man. You got a bigger net in your back pocket oh, somewhere? Oh, yeah, right. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sure. I'm going to put this rod down. You hold on to uh, that you, fish. Uh, <laughs> I'm going to have to two-hand this baby. Oh, my gosh. What a beauty. Look at that. Hop out there in midstream. I'll just, <laughs> yeah, I'll just right. swing and stick the net out and I will swing him by you, buddy. Because right now, right now, Steve, uh, this guy is doing what he wants to do. I well, just, you're getting him over here on the right I, side. I just anyway. don't want to see me get mad and uh, attack me. You know what I mean? I, I don't, Let's I, see if we can sneak up on him. That's what it's going to take to get him the net. Just get him to the net here. Come on, stay up, stay up. Gee whiz, stay up, stay up, stay up. Drop that baby and stay up, stay up, stay up, stay up, stay up. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I don't think he's going to stay in there, just to be honest with you. Wow. Holy that's, cow. That's a four pound fish. Man, man I'll tell you, Steve, that's nice. That's the, big, that's, that's the biggest trout I've ever caught in, well, it's the biggest trout other than the, in the steelhead. And that, that steelhead size, look at the size of that thing. What? He's still got a lot oh, of fight yeah, left in him, too. Huh? Wow. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Fun. oh that was fun. <laughs> oh, man. Good job. <laughs> that was fun. <laughs> Good job. I tell you, that's, uh, oh. that's amazing to get that size oh, of fish I, I, and, and, from yeah. over that side yeah. of the creek to yeah. this side of the creek and exactly. put him in the net. You know, that's an accomplishment. Well, he, he did well. Well, thank you. It was a, yeah, he's right there, right where he said he was. Well, Robert, thanks again for inviting me over here today. I tell you, it's, it's been a great day. We've caught some beautiful fish today. Some of the best fish that you'll find anywhere in the eastern United States. Tell us a little bit about uh, the strategy we use today to do that. Steve, how can you come to a place like this and not have a great day? It's I'm, beautiful, I mean, really. Well, we knew the water was flowing, had rain, water's going fast, so we've got to put some weight on and get the flies down to where the fish are. And you see that pool here, you figure it's around seven, eight feet deep. We've been fishing pools that are anywhere from four feet down. So we've had to use rods that are stouter than I normally use in mm -hmm. Carolina stream, but we've mm -hmm. caught some fish that are bigger than we normally catch in a regular North Carolina stream. Absolutely. Tell us something about the, uh, the ideas you had on changing the flies, because you put me on some good ones that I don't normally use. Well, uh, obviously, we, it, we learned real quick it was going to have to get down. Yep. And we had to get something big uh, mm -hmm. that the fish could really pick out. So we started with streamers, or I did, started with a streamer, right, and I know you right. started with a, a large nymph, right. the egg pattern and so forth, and we caught some fish, but uh, probably the, uh, the best uh, fly uh, nymph for the day for me anyway was the stone fly, the large mm -hmm. stone fly. Mm -hmm. But we had to get a lot of weight to get them down there, bounce it off the bottom, and basically hit the fish in the head with, uh, with the nymph. Yeah. But uh, if you could do that more, I tell you, oh, you could catch some nice fish. It, it, the, the force of this water and those fish it's just something else. I, I'm amazed at the strength of the fish. They're you know? the jumpers. Yeah, they're jumpers. Mm -hmm. It was fun, just fun. Well, thanks again. I appreciate it, and yeah. I hope we can do this again sometime. Oh, let's do in it. In the near future. Let's do it, buddy. Thanks, Robert. Enjoy appreciate it. it. Hi, I'm Joe Albee. And I'm John Moore, inviting you to join us each week as we will explore the fishing possibilities from the mountains to the coast.